My dearest Molly, this is the day for which I have always dreamed. The day for which I have always prayed. I have always dreamed that I would fall in love so deeply. I would vow my entire life over to that person. I have always dreamed of a beautiful love story and always hoped that I would fall in love with my best friend. And God managed to bring me just that in you, despite my best efforts to write the story myself. I'm so unbelievably in love with you. You are quite honest, the light of my life. They do not take my light from me. I lay it down freely. John 10, 18. You are my best friend, and I cannot wait to just grow into better followers of Christ together. You make me better in every way. All that I am is a gift for you, a gift that I give freely with no reservations. I have no idea what the future holds, but I'm ready to experience all of it with you. I was thinking recently about the person that I was before we started dating. The person I was before I even met you. And just how much you've helped me to grow into the man that I want to be. Take you, Molly, to be my wife. I promise to be faithful to you in good times and in bad, in sickness and in health, to love you and to honor you all the days of my life. I, Molly, take you, Zachary, to be my husband. I promise to be faithful to you in good times and in bad, in sickness and in health to love you and to honor you all the days of my life. May the Lord in his kindness strengthen the consent you have declared before the church and graciously bring to fulfillment his blessing within you. What God joins together, let no one put asunder. Happy to present for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Zachary Stevens. You guys have a deep, Christ-centered relationship that is 
truly transformative, and it's been super inspiring to watch. In our lives, there may be things that try to come between me and you. Mm -hmm. Truly a godly man who's confident in himself, funny, sincere, selfless, and a man of faith. And you love, love Molly very, very much. And I'm so honored to call you my son-in-law. But if I'm being honest, after I've gotten to know you, you're like a second son to me. It was a whirlwind romance in the best sort of way. And a truly a relationship built on the firm foundation of Christ. Hold my breath, pinch my skin. Jesus more because of you, Molly. You have healed so much of my heart. Your choice to risk it all for a chance at love has radically transformed who I am, healed me in ways I didn't think were possible, and has given me the greatest gift that I will ever receive next to my relationship with Jesus. All I want to do right now is thank you, and then I want to spend the rest of my life with you. I love you with every fiber of my being. All because of you, all for you, and all beside you for the rest of my life. I will love you and serve you until death do us part, and today is just the beginning.